Hi, my name is Bjorn and this is a Yeti tutorial on how to control length and density using a texture map. And I'm going to save this out as a TIFF file. Yeti doesn't like PNGs or JPEGs. And this is even though it's only supposed to look at the RGB channel. Right, so I'm just going to hide this geometry and move on to his chest because we're going to give him chest hair. So I import my my geometry and I create a texture node. And in this texture node I'm going to load in the texture that I just saved out as a TIFF. Next thing I want to do is go to attributes and type in a variable, density in this case. And we'll leave this at RGB. Don't forget to tell Yeti about the V coordinates because for some reason, even though Yeti is a plugin for Maya, it still doesn't read a UV map the same way Maya does. So you have to just flip the UV uh, or the, the V chord dnet. Next I'm going to make a scatter node and activate the it like so and we see it's the first growing exactly where I painted. Now the area I painted on my texture map is in fact on his chest so that is where we're going to see the result. <clears throat> so obviously the lower con the lower value uh, black is no, no density, nothing and white is 100%. So that is just like any other alpha. So if we render it out, we can see it still has the same length. So we can control the length too. And we're just going to add another texture node here. And this time we're going to load in the file as before. And we're going to write in attributes length. And don't forget to change the coordinate of the UV map. And we're just going to plug this in there and this into our grow node. Now nothing's happened yet, so we need to go into our grow node. And as I hope you remember, we just typed in length in the texture node. And that is what we want to put into the length multiplier of the grow node. So type in dollar sign length and hit enter or whatever you want to hit. And then you're done. And you can use this method for all kinds of whatever you want to control basically. It's the same principle. So just go ahead and experiment with that. And if you want to watch more Yeti tutorials or other tutorials, then you should take note of the text in front of you appearing right now. Type it into your browser window and hit enter or whatever you want to hit.